Hello everyone, Trey Man White here, and we're back with another Pokemon Sun and Moon anime review. And today, guys, we're talking about episode 28, the Pokebase episode. And guys, for a filler episode, this episode was amazing. The animation was amazing. The story was amazing. <laughs> All the funny faces. There was so much comedy in this episode. It was amazing from start to finish. I love this episode a lot, guys. The episode was amazing, guys. We... It was so much, so much detail put into, like, all of the character scenes where they were introducing the characters. But, hang on, I'll get to that after we start this, the summary. The episode basically begins with Ash and the group. Basically, or well, Ash and Kiawe, I mean, not Kiawe, Kakui, watching Pokebase on TV. And Ash is, like, so amazed about it. He's like, man, I want to, I want to play Pokebase. So, Kakui notices this, and basically... I'm guessing Kakui's planning what they're going to do tomorrow in class. So basically, the next day, they're all in class, and Kakui asks, do, do y'all know about Pokebase? And Ash is like, yeah, I love, I can't wait, I want to play so badly and stuff. And basically, the guy who they were watching, the, the athlete that they were watching play Pokebase, actually came to the school with a Alolan Oak. And that was pretty cool that, like, they actually had him come to the school. Like, I was like, Wow. They even get to play with him later on in the episode, like play Pokebase with him. But basically, he's an announcer at first. We get the character introductions in. I love these scenes a lot because they were going by each character one by one. We have Kiawe, the thrower. We have Ash, the batter. And like they did it for each character, even the Pokemon. Like they, they showed the Pokemon a lot of attention in this episode. And that was really cool that they did those for Poke the Pokemon too. It was really cool. I really love these these scenes a lot. They were so detailed and animated well. And then we get Ash to the bat. Like, Ash is the batter. Kiawe is the thrower. The pitcher. And Kiawe basically, he pitches the ball. Throws it. And the way he throws it, he's like doing his Z, like Z move. The fire type Z movement. It, it was so cool how they did that. Even when Ash hits it with the bat, Ash is like... Using Gigavolt Havoc, basically. It's, it's really cool how they did it. Even though Ash missed the ball. And this is the coolest part. Scyther is there calling Strike. Because in Japan, Scyther's name is Strike. So, it was so cool when, how they used Scyther like that. Like, that was really cool. He's like, Strike! <laughs> it, was, it was like, like that was cool that they made that. Like, made a meme about that, basically. I found that really funny. But yeah, guys, basically everybody is playing Pokebase. This is really cool. We get to see, like, Mallow, Mallow, Steeny, Pikachu gets to be the pitcher. And Pikachu, it, it was really cool how Pikachu did it. Because Pikachu used his tail. I was like, how's Pikachu going to throw it? But he used his tail to his advantage. And that was really cool. I found it funny how they were all just having a good time and stuff and basically coaching each other. Sophocles almost missed the ball because... When I, I forgot which character it was, but somebody hit the ball and Sophocles had to go and catch it. And he fell and ended up catching it still. Everybody was like, yay, Sophocles! <laughs> Even though he didn't mean to. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. Lily also tried to catch the ball, but Lily, Lily was so excited. She's like, I'm going to catch it. I'm going to catch it. But when the ball got closer, she got scared and ducked down and covered up. But basically, Alolan Vulpix came and caught the ball. So that was really cool that, like, their bond is so strong. Like they, they actually show a moment between those two characters. And yet Lana, Lana comes up. And I think this might be foreshadowed that Lana is getting the water type Z move Z crystal soon. Because first we see in the um T Rocket, the episode where T Rocket get the Dark MZ, she keeps using the Water MZ. And in this one we Kiawe uses his his like basically like Z throw. <laughs> I guess Z throw. We get to see waves behind Lana and Lana imagining the bat actually being a fishing pole. And when she hits it, she gets a home run and Kiao is just heartbroken. Like, he's like, I can't believe this happened. Like, he, he was so depressed and it was hilarious, guys. And basically, when the ball hits the home run, it goes and ironically hits me off right in the face. Because they're outside just taking a stroll. So they come on in and basically like they're all mad like hey who did that? And Jesse, she falls in love with the professional baseball player, Pokebase player. And cuz she actually had a picture of him and she was like talking about him. 
before Miyak got hit. And when she sees him, she just changes her whole character, her whole personality changes. She went from being all mean and mad to seeing him in all hard eyes and stuff. And I was like, wow, Jesse. But here's where it gets good. Now it's Ash in the group versus Team Rocket. And now the professional baseball players and his Snorlax is in it as well. And yeah, basically, we, we get to see Meowth like, oh, I've been training my horse for quite a while. Throws the ball. It gets hit. Meowth is like, what? And stuff. Bro. It, it was really cool, though. Like how they were playing together. Snorlax comes up. Oh, before Snorlax came up, Mimikyu <laughs> was the pitcher. And Pikachu was the batter. And Mimikyu launches the ball, almost takes Pikachu's head off, and basically the ball flew into a part of the school. I was like, dang, like Mimikyu really, really hates Pikachu that much. Like he almost took his head off. Even Meowth was looking scared. Cause Meowth was in the back, like supposed to catch the ball and stuff. And Meowth was even too scared. <laughs> it went right past him. Mimikyu does not like Pikachu one bit. And that, that was really cool that they showed that. But Snorlax comes up. And basically, Snorlax is the batter. And Snorlax is just sitting there. Meowth throws the ball. The ball bounces off the bat and it's basically just rolling. Snorlax is standing there. Mariani gets the ball and James is like, Mariani, throw it to me quick. So Mariani just gets all excited and falls in love with James and basically chomps the James head. I was like, dang. <laughs> and basically, like the ball is just, just, just still moving. And this is where it gets cool. The professional pokey base player uses his Z move. Like he he just pulls out the Z Z ring and uses pulverizing pancake with Snorlax. And Snorlax runs all bases. Like and I was just like, wow. Like I was I wasn't expecting that. That was actually a surprise right there that he, he, pulverizing pancake was shown. And poor Wubbuffet. First I felt bad for Kiawe because Snorlax rolled over and crushed Kiawe, but Wubbuffet had it bad. When <laughs> Wubbuffet caught the ball, Meowth got the ball and passed it to Wubbuffet. Wubbuffet caught the ball. Snorlax jump when he when he's coming down, basically past the third base, jumps in the air and basically slams down on Meowth, pulverized and pancake him. <laughs> and Wubbuffet drops the ball. Poor Wubbuffet. Even after the pulverizing pancake, Wubbuffet was all flat and just fl floating away in the wind and stuff. But yeah, and that was basically the game. Ash just team one, and yeah. But here's something else. At the end of the episode, the professional Pokebase player gives J Jesse his autograph, and Jesse is like, oh my gosh, and all the hard eyes and stuff. And the minute she's about to grab it, Beware just comes and just sonic speed and <laughs> grabs Jesse and all the other Team Rocket members, and they go off again. Jesse's like, no! But yeah, guys, this episode was really good. I enjoyed this episode a whole lot. It was very funny how, like, the funny faces and how, like, how well the animation was. The animation in this episode was spot on. It was it was an amazing episode. And I really enjoyed it a lot. And yeah. But I, and even Team Rocket. Team Rocket weren't even trying to catch Pikachu in them. They were just here to play the game. But I hope you all enjoyed the review. Thank you all for watching. Yeah, Trey Man 1. Peace out.